Now there's just over one week remaining before the local elections here in Korea and the main rival parties were out campaigning over the weekend in the most hotly contested constituencies. The ruling Senate party stumped in Gyeonggi-do province, a key battleground that is home to the victims and their families of the Sewolho ferry disaster, while the opposition New Politics Alliance for Democracy campaigned in Seoul and in Incheon. A new education proposal became a controversial issue over the weekend, in fact, after Kim Jin-pyo, the opposition candidate for Gyeonggi-do province governor, promised to make daycare centre workers government employees to boost their job stability. The ruling Senuri party blasted his proposal, saying it would cost the country, the economy, roughly 10 billion US dollars.